Viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Okay. This is me and I'm on my way to the club. Say hi. Hi. You ready to go to grandma's house? Yeah. Mommy gotta go get some sh money. I love you. I'm getting ready right now. I just did my hair today. Ladies, it's not looking that bad, honey. I'm proud of myself because it's been a process trying to get my laces to lay right. I haven't went dancing since my last stripper vlog. Um, like I told you guys in the last video, like stripping for me is part time. I'm very boring. I would rather be home in my bed watching Blacklist, eating some barbecue Pringles, than to be in the club, okay? Every time I do go dancing, it's by myself. I hate drama, so that's another reason why I choose not to really so like socialize in the club. I haven't been consistent. I haven't been able to really save money because like I'll make money from the club and then I'll just sit home for like a month and just slowly pick at the money I made. So my new goal for this week is to just really just be consistent. Um, I don't know when is the next time I'm actually gonna go dance because I am starting college soon. It's nine o'clock, you guys. And I have orientation tomorrow for school at 10 o'clock in the morning. These curls is giving like cartoon character vibes. I am so tired of being broke. I'm tired of living paycheck to paycheck, however you want to call it. I'm tired of living the poor life. My last vlog, like I felt like I was inconsistent. And another thing is like, I'm so glad that I'm actually putting out more content that's like really living in my truth. The time like when I was recording like stripper content, I was afraid to see what people would think about me and so i would take the videos down and then put them back up take them down put it back up i'm so glad i got to the point where i don't even care what people think about me like i don't care if somebody has something negative to say about me i don't even care because guess what i know what my goals are i know what type of person i am a lot of people have judgment when it comes to the strip club because they automatically think okay like this person is the hoe and i started to just trust god and trust the process because this is not going to be my life forever like this is just the i have to weather the storm to get to where i want to be this is me and i'm i'm gonna be me to the day i die and that's just that not everybody is going to like you not everybody is going to support you not everybody is going to love you and that's okay and I'm grateful. And I'm grateful for my 1,500 subscribers because we're on the road to 2K. And guess what? We're going to get this shmoney. And we ain't going to care what nobody, nobody got to say. We know where we want to be in life. So that's all that matters. You guys, I'm on my way to the club. Yes, indeed. And look at this fucking mom mobile they done gave me to drive because my car is currently getting serviced. So they gave me this car to drive for now. And it's just giving mom mobile. <laughs> I miss my car so much. The fastest I can go in this is probably 80 miles per hour. I'm about to go work, you guys. Y'all wish me luck. I pray that tonight is a good night. Please, God, please. Bye, you guys. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna um record when I get to the club.
What's up, y'all? So, as you guys can see, your girl is dusty. My curls done dry. I just want to give you guys the rundown of my night. Because one thing I'm not going to do is get on here and lie about how much money I made. I will never get on here and lie about where, like, what I'm doing. Like, that's lame as hell. That is so lame. But And basically, so I ended up going to this club that I usually work at because it's right by my house. Y'all. The night was so bad. Like, it was literally so dead. No money. No customers to even finesse. It was nobody to even talk to. So, something just told me, let me just go to this other spot. So, let me tell y'all how God worked. Because God is so good to me. On my way to the other spot, you guys. Like, I swear to God, I was on my... I was saying... Let me just go home. Let me, I don't want to waste no money. Let me just go home. I just know where I need to go tomorrow. Y'all, something just told me, go ahead and take your ass to the spot. As long as you keep trying, God will never let you down. And I'm a living testimony. One, two, three, four, five, 100, 200, one, two, three, four. Four, five, three hundred, one, two, three, four, five, four hundred, one, two, three, four, five. So I ended up getting a cash app, you guys, and this is the cash app that I got. This was almost 12 a.m., 1156. I got a hundred dollar cash app. So I ended up making six hundred dollars, and I cannot complain. And I was about to go home with $30. Next day. Well, I just finished cleaning up and I'm about to drop off Riley. Say hi. Hi. You ready to go to grandma's house? Yeah. Again? So guys, I just came from my second day of my stripper vlog and I'm going to do a money count but it's not even worth doing a money count. I didn't make no bread. <laughs> like I probably made like my tip out back because my tip out, I went to a new club. My tip out was, um, my tip out was $30 and i stayed for i got there at seven it's now it's 10 o'clock i got to work it was so dead you guys like almost two and a half hours i barely made my tip out back and a lot of people was trying to dance me but i couldn't stay because i gotta go get riley so that's another thing about dancing like you have to be able to work and actually like work 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 and it's fucking people fucking staring at me and I'm in the car, but whatever. I don't even care. Like, mind your business. So, it's day two. I didn't make no money, but I'm still going. And I'm not even mad I didn't make no money. Like, at least I made my tip all back and a little bit more than what I came with. That's all that matters to me. So, yeah. Walk into my car. I'm about to go ahead and go work. I put some bottom lashes on. I can't really see them, but. It's really aggravating when you're getting 20 twenty dollars here, twenty dollars there, twenty dollars here, twenty dollars there. Like that's aggravating. Like throw some money so I can leave. Like. 
Everybody that was like dancing me kept saying like I never see you in here like you knew was like asking if I did rooms and when you do a room that's not just dancing like that's fucking and sucking and I don't do that. I was dancing for was asking like do you do rooms do you do rooms. And I kept saying rooms, like, what is room? And they was like, sex, sex, sex. And I was like, no, like, I'm too pretty for that. I'm mad because, like, what am I out here dancing for? Like, so I'm just going to go ahead and count this. Like, this is 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, $100. 20, 40, 40, 60, 80, $100. So that's 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100. So that's $300, 51. $51. So I made 300 and fifty six dollars and tip out was seventy so like what the fuck <sighs> I'm debating if I should go to another club or what put my money up here so I'm gonna wipe my car down with these antibacterial hand wipes y'all I literally was standing outside trying to go in this club to dance and I just seen a badass an accident like they running from the police the police like was right behind them and they fucking wrecked out right in front of the club i'm going home i could not believe that like i was standing outside trying to go inside the club the guy was telling me like it's a waste don't even try to come in here i'm trying to see if i can make a u-turn so i can show y'all like i'm not playing it just really hurt my heart because a lot of people be getting into these bad accidents and don't be making it out alive and they was hitting the brakes and it was squealing like scratch Dip. i was craving tacos so bad so i'm about to make some tacos yeah before i go work tonight to work now I'm a little late today because my mom had to do something so it's like 10 o'clock probably more than that let me see it is 10 06 so I'm about to go to this new club I've been trying a lot of new clubs <laughs> Um, I'm really mad because I didn't, I wasn't able to go to the dance store to get new outfits. So that's why I'm going to these new clubs. So we'll see how it goes tonight. hundreds so I ended up making one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so that's a thousand a thousand one hundred and and this is twenty dollars eleven twenty last night so I'm really grateful dude who I danced for really showed out thanks so much for watching if you stuck around